There you are, finally. If you were any later in showing up, we would have had to abandon this. I've been calling to the Takata mother in their language. She should respond fairly... Ah, here she comes now. Get ready. This will not be easy. She's a tough beast. <laughs> the beast is dead. We work better together than I would have hoped. And here is the holocron. Such a small thing to be so valuable and require so much effort to obtain. I'll just run along now and give this to Master Uthar. I'll be sure to tell him of your contribution, naturally. You're not getting the holocron. This was my idea. The plan was that I take it back, not you. Back off. I'm warning you. I'm not giving this up. Over my dead body. <laughs> What? Your wish? Yes?
Another idiotic student has stumbled into my little web, eh? The contact mole toxin in the air should knock you out quickly enough. <laughs> Welcome. Awake already, are you? Good. This is the tomb of Sith Lord Tulak Horde, if you don't know. I've taken up residence here for now. It's dusty and full of critters, but it's home. Oh, yes. Introductions, of course. I suppose it is time, isn't it? This other student here that I captured earlier, you should know well enough. His name is Miko. Say hello, Miko. <laughs> Poor lad. He's had a hard day. My name is Jorak Earl. I was once the head of the academy, so I'm sure you've heard of me. Oh, my, my, my. Such glorious vim. If I could bottle it and drink it, I would. <laughs> There's a thought. Anyhow, I'd like to propose that we move on to the main event. You see, I'd like to discover if you've got the pluck of an old-fashioned Sith. Most of the Drek Uthar has been passing through these days is so pathetic. Take young Miko here. I already tested him, didn't I, Miko? Uh, I... Uh... Yes, yes, you're welcome. You see, Miko here has the cruel disposition of a Sith, but not the gumption that I'm looking for. And then you go free. I'll even pass on to you my own personal thesis on ancient Sith philosophy. They're based on all I've learned studying two lakhs too. They'll make you a better Sith, I'm sure. The chances of you passing, however, are certainly remote. Ah, what's a little mental instability between tutor and pupil? What's important is that I'm here to better the Sith as a whole. It's a big job. I don't remember offering you a choice. You can refuse to answer my questions, of course, but then, I'm afraid, I will just have to assume the worst. So then, this is how it goes. I'm going to pose a moral question to you. Get it right, and I torture Miko. Get it wrong, and I torture you. Miko here is a bit weak. He probably won't be able to take much more punishment. Find you. Get too many wrong. And you will die yourself. I don't know what you think of Miko. Maybe you don't like him. Maybe you think he deserves to be murdered. Well, here's your chance, fair enough. Well then, any last comments before we begin, Miko? We can both survive. Attack him together. Now, now, dear lad, do you really think your friend here will answer questions wrong just to spare little you risking their own life? And how many correctly answered questions before you die? Hmm? No, don't be silly. You had your chance, remember? On that note, let's begin. Now then, your immediate superior amongst the Sith is an effective commander and a fine leader. He trusts you and you like him. You see an opportunity to kill him. What do you do? Then I must assume you did not know the correct answer. Sad, really, that you would do this to yourself. Ah, well, it's time for your punishment. And so we come to round two. You come across a group of humans who are threatened by dangerous animals. They plead for help, offering you a reward. What do you do? Correct! 
the humans would no doubt just be preyed upon by something else later. Stand up for yourself, I say. We're not Jedi shepherds after all. Sadly, Miko, the ingenuity of your fellow student is your loss. This is going to hurt. Let's see. Ah, yes. You discover an aspect of the Force that gives you great power. Do you share it and strengthen the Sith as a whole? Or keep it to yourself? And here I thought this question was an easy one. Oh, well, suit yourself. Oh. Well, you did ask for this. It's for your own good. Still going? All right, then. One of your underlings has made a major mistake which makes you look bad. He's normally very competent and skilled. Do you kill him or give him another chance? You're not trying to make me angry, are you? That would be pointless posturing on your part. Is this so hard? <laughs> not that good help is easy to find. Oh well, here's your reward. Last question. You're about to die. Do you pass on your knowledge to your apprentice to make him stronger? Or do you use your last breath to strike at your enemy? <laughs> Such insolent students I get these days. You deserve this. And then some. I'll enjoy this one. Time for your medicine. is over and you're both still alive. Well, that's never happened before. Hmm. What to do? What to do? I suppose this means you can go, Miko. We'll have to just figure out what to do with our friend here. Run along now. Or, or I could use the Force to free them. And we could kill you. Seems you didn't think of that, old man. What? Lutiny! Behave, students! I'll... That's it! Detention for all of you! Permanent detention! What is it? easily just answered those questions and let me die. Well, you can have those writings he mentioned. I won't fight you for them. Master Uthar will be very pleased if you give them to him, you know. I'll head back to the Academy. I need some rest. That 
Your wish? Huh? Yes? Yes? Your wish? Yes? What? Yes? can do better than I. This Mandalorian is proving more resistant than I expected. I'm trying to get him to tell us where his weapon cache is hidden. So far, all the serum combinations I'm using are proving ineffective. If I bring his drug threshold too high, he'll go into shock and be useless. Too low, and he just refuses to talk. It's been maddening. Just activate the console. It gives you a variety of options for serum dosage. The right amount applied at the right rate should do it. The real trick is that the only way to gauge your progress is to watch the prisoner closely for his reaction. Our scanners can't pick up his vitals. Certainly. Uh, just don't kill him or send him into shock. He's supposed to be questioned, not executed. If you manage to get the location of his cash out of him, I'll be sure to pass on the good word to Master Yutha. 
Your wish? What? What? We eat a non diet. What do you want to undertake? ほど Ranano Prata Dogo Shir Achuta Wonga Kun Bis Dolpi Kipuna Kavadopa Ku Palea Muk Ucha Hatonga Ya Fulke Jachiska to Punta Casa Pupaka Yes, I heard that. Excellent job. Thank you for locating the cash. Naturally, I would see rewarded, but I would prefer that everyone believe that I extracted the information. Of course not. Information extraction is my specialty. I'm not about to let it be known that some wealth did my job better. You had some fun, didn't you? Now run along, and let's not turn this into anything unpleasant. Oh? I suppose one would need to be alive to go running to Master Yutha to report the location of the cache, wouldn't they? Does that mean that you're ready to battle a true Sith then? Shall we make an issue of it? Ha! Gather your anger then, and let us see who is superior! Your wish? <laughs> I heard of that. Yes. Human monster! Greetings, young one. You have much to do yet. You have gained little prestige. You will have to work quickly if you hope to best the others. Then finish the code as I speak it. Peace is a lie. That is only... Through passion, I gain... Through strength, I gain... Through power, I gain... Through victory... The Force shall free me. Yes, good. You have indeed learned the code of the Sith. Speaking the words and knowing the words are, however, two different things. Tell me then, true or false? It is our passion that fuels the Force. Well done. I will test you no more. You know the code. Very impressive. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. Ah, the ones I ordered executed for their mutiny. It's done then. Indeed, 
I had the caverns checked after you left. Well done. The lesson is learned, I believe. Go now. You have done well, but you have not impressed me enough to declare you the victor. I have matters to attend to. Ah, finally, the genuine sword. I knew that this relic would be unearthed in time. I can feel the power flowing through it. Well done. You have impressed me greatly. Go now. You have done well. Yes, so I hear. I've had reports from some students that ventured into the tomb after you left and found the parts. Well done. I am impressed. You have rid us of a potential nuisance. Go now. Ah, my old master. Still, unless you bring back something of his, some writings are similar, I am unimpressed. Jorak's fate means nothing to me. <laughs> I had heard that such an artifact existed. Tell me, young one, did you acquire the device by yourself? So I see. And Lasho, does she yet live? <laughs> well done. You gained an artifact through trickery and eliminated an opponent at the same time. That is deserving of great prestige. You have impressed me enough, by my estimation, to become a Sith and fall. Congratulations, young one. You have bested the others quite completely. You have but one final test which you must take, and this requires us to travel to the tomb of Nagasado in the Valley of the Dark Lords. I would advise you to be rested and equipped before we leave. Return to your quarters now and seek me out in the morning. When you return, make sure that you have all you will need, for you will face your test alone. Go, and may the Force serve you well.